Hello. 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 All right, we are going to read our books, My New School, before we get our new books today, okay? So I want you to whisper read it, and I'm going to listen in and listen to you read, okay? Yes, ma'am. Okay, go ahead and begin. My New School. I have a blue cat. Whisper read to yourself. I have a new Great job. Okay, put those in front of you. Okay, we're going to talk about some words that you can hear the middle sound of words. Okay. Okay. Do you get your stretches out? Yes. All right. You can hear the middle sound of a word. Okay. Ah. Like at ah, and what? What? Apple. Like. Man, you read my mind. Like an apple. Because I knew it and like All right. Andrew. That's how you spell apple. So, like apple, like Andrea. Andrea. And me. I started with A at the disease. Or at. <coughs> and or am. And the middle of. And, of, and. Um, and. The middle. And, and. Okay, let's. Cat. What were you going to say? Listen to Joshua because he said something very wise. Hat. Hat. Where is the A sound? In, in the middle. In the middle. So he found a word with the A sound in the middle. Ma oh, now I got one. Like mat. Turtle. Does that have the A sound? No. Not the mat. The A sound. What about... Like. Like. Like that. This one. Man. Man. Very good. So sometimes you can hear the A sound in the middle of the words too. Okay. Let's start our new um, Jack in the Box. All right, let's talk about this book first. This is here. Let's talk about this book first. What type of shoes do you see on the cover? Oh, yellow shoes and black shoes. They are yellow and shoes. Boots. They're boots. Tap shoes. Right? Maybe tap shoes. Maybe regular shoes. Crown. We're looking on the front cover, Joshua. Thank you. So we have yellow boots and we have what kind of shoes? Black, black shoes. shoes. Very good. What do you do in these boots? You wear them for to, uh, to walk in for the snow. snow. For snow or rain, mm -hmm. right? What or about these? Puddles. To walk to walk in and maybe tap like like the mirror Two side. Races. Good. Let's look at page two and three. Are you making your feet tap? What about these boots? A rib. Cowboy shoes. They are red cowboy boots. What do you do in these boots? You oh, for horses. Horse and, and for horses. You can ride. ride. Yeah. Good. So he says, yeah. he says, look at my boots. Can you find at? Say at. At. But what comes first in at? A. Like we just did, right? Can you find at? Find it with your finger? Run, run your finger underneath it and say at. Uh, Very good. All right, now turn the page. Turn the page. The boy says to look at his shoes. He says, what can he do in these shoes? Tap. Tap. And yes. dance. He says he can dance in his Tap shoes. And dance. Good job. He can dance. Okay, turn the page. What are those? What can he do with his shoes? Run and jump. Is he run? Oh, mm. you're on the wrong page. Oh. He can walk 
Walk. Walk. We call that um, walking and hiking, right? And boots? Yeah. Good. He says, can. I can walk. Can you find the word can? Can. What letter would you think C comes first in can? C. C. Very good. Can you run your finger underneath it just like Zamir and say can? can. Very good. All right, turn all the way to page 10. That's easy. What can the boy do in these boots? Skate. Skate. Is he skating or skiing? Skiing. He's skiing. Very good. Yes, he can ski in these boots. Okay, let's nope. turn back to the beginning. Yes, and whisper read with your, but I'm going to listen in, so make sure you whisper it so I can listen. I can look my boots. I can write. mostly about uh, dancing and jumping. Was it about dancing and jumping? Yes. Look at no. my shoes. It was about shoes and what else? And then dancing. I mean, what was it mostly about? They did dance in there, didn't they? But what was the uh, main idea of this? No running. Was it about running? No. What was and shoes? The book was telling us all about boots and shoes. Right, boots and shoes. So what was it mostly about? Boots, boots and, and shoes. shoes. Very good. And then it also told us things they did. So what were some of the things people did with uh, their boots and shoes? I'm Zamir, tell me one thing. I'm done with this. Okay, please give it to me so you stop playing with it. Uh, he, he was running. He was running with his shoes. Andrea, can you please tell me another thing? Uh, he... He's riding a horse. Mm -hmm. Joshua, can you tell me another thing? That he's kicking. He is. And what, then what happened at the end? Who showed their shoes? <gasps> uh, Joshua? There's a clown. A clown with his shoes. What does a clown use his shoes for? So. Um, so, so, you can can scare people? so you can scare people? Maybe. My what else? Scared of a clown for its do you think clowns try to scare people or do you oh, think they try to make them laugh? Laugh. Yeah. Which clown yeah, is it does, too? It this does scare part, people. Monday. Hold on, Samir. Do you think that clowns' big shoes sometimes make people laugh? Yeah, maybe they do. Maybe make it's, people laugh. It, that's what they do with Donald's feet. That those do look my, like McDonald's feet. Why is that word dark? Look at page 16. Go to page 16. Zamir. It's big. Why is that dark? 
What do you think, Because Andrea? Because it's black and you have to say it out loud. Yeah, how do you say it? What does your voice say? Look at my, my shoes. shoes. Very good. Do you remember what we call words that are dark like that? You say it out loud. Do you remember what we say they are, though? We say they're bold words. Bold words. And that means that you say them loudly. You're very good with your voice in bold words. Excellent job. I see an ING. Zamir, what were you going to say? I see an ING. You do change your mind, you don't want to say it? Okay, we're gonna what we're gonna do is close your book. We're gonna look at our high frequency words this week. And when you see a friend that a word that your friend has, try to match them up, okay? So lay them out in front of you. Lay them out. Lay them out in front of you. And who can find and we gotta name them too. So all right, Andrea, you go first. What do you have? I have look. Okay, who else can find look? Me. I have it. Oh, there it is. <laughs> yep, you have look. Okay, put that aside because you matched them. Like that. All right, Samira, what do you have? Like. Like, can you hold it up? Who else has like? There we go. Okay, flip them over. Joshua? Me. Is that me or mine? Mine. Mine. Very good. Make sure you grab the right one. Hold on. Look at what Joshua is holding. What's the difference between that one and the other because one? Because you don't got no E in it. Because it's which. So it has a different ending, doesn't it? Yes. You're right, Zamir. Thank you for making that switch. Okay, Zamir or Andrea. From. From. Who can find from? Yep, that's yours. Very good. Okay. All right, what else do we have? Zamir. Good. Excellent. Good. Good. Awesome. Joshua. Man. Man. Who is man? Do you have man? There we go. Andrea. Make. Make. Everybody, everybody gets the same word, that's what. We do have the same words. And then what is our last Me. word? Me. Me. Oh, my goodness. And you can put those inside your word bag so that you can practice them at home. We don't home. have a bag. Yes, we do. Oh, yes, we do inside our bag. Okay, and then I'll give you this book to practice, practice, practice reading at home, okay? High five for good reading today. I thought on Fridays we go to treasure box. <laughs> on Thursdays we go to treasure box. Let's watch it.